currently 7, I mean 11.30 p.m. Now, this is some chicken salad that Dad's mom made and gave to Dad when he stopped by his parents' place after work. I assume it was after... He went to Salvatore's after work. He went to Salvatore's after work and then to his parents' place. As he doesn't have a mini fridge in his car to keep something like this fresh. And even if he did, I'm not sure if a car really has enough electricity to power a mini fridge. What I'm thinking you would have to use would be some kind of portable cooler. Uh... But I think Dad only brings something like that for his lunch, if that. I recall him getting home somewhere between... 7.30 p.m. and 8.30 p.m. From then on until pretty much now, I had a couple cups of coffee while working on the scarf for the snowman polystring cup drawing. The scarf is nearly done. If I recall, I did the hat uh, for which I ultimately decided to just essentially draw a line to serve as a sort of hat border with this Sharpie marker, then color all the area above in, including the surface area of the top, with that same Sharpie marker. And at the time, I think it was... Roughly 8 to 9 in the morning. I was thinking of that maybe I, after coloring in that area. I would somehow find a darker color to serve as a sort of hat trim border between the hat itself and the flap around the hat that sticks out at the bottom of that hat.
I believe I was thinking at the time that I would start, I would do lightest color first, essentially. And then I believe I thought that if I wanted to leave enough room to do you know, the head with eyes and a mouth made out of coal, a carrot nose, and a corn pop pipe, I essentially had to leave the hat with not enough room to really do a bottom flap around it. So the only detail I could really do was the trim around the hat. For which I think only a black Sharpie marker, fine tip, would really be visible against a medium gray Sharpie marker. I completed the hat in the morning. And before I fell asleep around 9.30 in the morning. I then woke up around 1.30 in the afternoon. Fell back to sleep. Woke up again at around 3.30 p.m. And that's when I got up and within half an hour, I worked on the scarf. Using these Sharpie markers for the diagonally striped pattern. I worked on it over the course of several hours while doing tasks on Elvenar and the Queen's Blade Limit Rake. Since it was a new day for that game by the time I woke up in the afternoon. These Sharpie markers are for the carrot nose. I think most likely both ends of this dual tip black Sharpie marker will be used for the eyes and mouth, and uh, this is for the pipe. After that, that'll just about be everything, but it's just a matter of in what order I decide to do these things. Uh, this was made by Dan's mom. In the morning, I think starting around 6.30, in the morning, Dad made me some coffee, which I had, I think, roughly from 6.45 
uh, during which around that time I also had a couple of buttered and toasted English muffins dad made for me. I think I finished the coffee by 8 in the morning. And then shortly after I got up in the afternoon, I got up in the afternoon around 3.30 p.m. and then about 15 minutes later, I had a bowl of granola cereal with whole milk. I think maybe... I think I recall within the first hours of today, I looked on Amazon for a first a... Uh, for a pack of, for some dark gray Sharpie markers to go with the light gray Sharpie markers that I looked for on Amazon uh, late yesterday. I don't think I'm going to need a dark gray Sharpie marker. Now for the snowman polystyrene cup. Although, I think uh, there's little visual difference between a medium and dark gray Sharpie marker. Generally, while working on this, I'm going to try to avoid having my fingers on an area I already colored on here, or do it as little, only as much as necessary, since uh, polystyrene cups are more susceptible to having marker bleed onto the surface of my skin, and when it does so, it takes some of the marker off of the polystyrene thus causing fading that I then have to fix by going over that area with the marker again. You know, I don't think I've experienced that problem this time so far, and hopefully it'll stay that way. At this point, I pretty much just have the details of the face in front to do.